Hey y'all, heading down the road, just left Omaha. I am headed back to Colorado to continue my Colorado Trail section hike. I probably won't video a whole lot of talking head on this trip just because I'm trying to save battery and save storage because uh, I'm hoping for a lot of footage. Guess we'll see. I'm sure that'll make a lot of people happy. And nobody likes looking at my ugly mug anyway. But we're on the road. Hopefully we have a safe trip. Okay, made it to Colorado. I am in Bailey. I'm back at Linwood Park for those of you that have been following along for a while. If you watch my failed Colorado through hike, uh, Colorado Trail through hike from last year, you have got first-hand experience of, of Linwood Park Hostel. Very nice place. They are going to let me store my van here while I'm out on trail. And uh, I've got a shuttle coming to pick me up to take me to two. I am going to go the goal is at the very minimum Kenosha Pass, which is I think the end of five, beginning of six. Uh, I would like to get to Breckenridge, but I'm not sure shuttle-wise what that would cost me to get back from the, from Breckenridge here to Bailey. I already know what it's going to cost me to get from here to Section Two, and because Two is so like out of the way, it's going to cost me an arm and a leg. But you got to do what you got to do. Uh, I wasn't going to park there and then try and get a shuttle driver to take me back to my van from there but anyway wasn't gonna park there and leave my van there it's so obscure I can almost guarantee it would have got broken into other than that if I am only out here for a week that's fine too because that means I'll be back in time for Mason's birthday he and I were both kind of bummed that this fell with his birthday right towards the end of it and there was a chance I was gonna miss it so Maybe I'll just do five days, go home, and then take him hiking for two days. That'd be a good birthday, too. Man, I'll tell you what, feels like I was just here yesterday. It's pretty hard to believe that it was almost a year ago. Matter of fact, it was a little more than a year ago because I just saw the photo show up on my Facebook timeline this morning before I left. But I was standing in this exact spot, this exact spot right here, mad at myself for pushing my son so far that he got hurt and it, our hike was over, 16 miles, our hike was over. A year later, I'm back, I am by myself. I almost brought Snot Rocket, but I just wasn't sure how well he'd be able to do it, how much he'd really enjoy trying to hike in the mountains. I know he likes hiking in the mountains, but backpacking, I just, I'm not sure he's ready for it yet. Um, Although, that last trip he was bugging me about wanting to bring his own tent next time. So he wants to solo tent now. <laughs> He's eight, he wants to solo. That's awesome. I love that kid. But it's about 7 o'clock. Tent's up. I ate some cold chicken nuggets back at the hostel before my ride showed up, before my shuttle showed up. And uh, I think I'm just going to eat some banana chips and check out the river for a while and crash. Get up as early as I can and tackle that bad boy. Haven't done any real hiking in four or five months. Hopefully I make it up. Guess we'll see.